patients come to us with flu symptoms and most of them have a panic situation that they have acquired covid-19 disease see covid-19 generally has a high grade of fever point number 1 point number 2 they have sore throat and one more thing is they present with dry cough and patients start to have difficulty in breathing the fever is not subsiding even after 3 days and patient continues to have breathing difficulty then definitely he has to consult a local physician in normal flu the fever is generally in milder form they have simple sore throat and which subsides in 3 days on its own fever is a very simple term but it has so much in it there are fevers which don't have flu as well like he has an episode of 3 to 4 days of fever following which he has body pain joints pain and all that so in that case it might be a dengue fever or a malarial fever malarial fever generally present with fever with chills and all that which occurs for every 2 days if the fever is not subsiding for 3 days they have to generally contact their physician fever generally is due to a infectious cause and a non infectious cause as well most common are infectious fevers infectious fevers the causes are again multiple like bacterial infections are more common and viral fevers are also more common and uh, there are fungal infections there will be parasitic infections as well like malaria helminthiasis non infectious causes of fevers are also plenty all the cancers like lymphoma leukemia they present with persistent fevers running for long days some drugs like atropine can cause fever in heat stroke also there might the patient might have fever which is a non infectious cause so the reasons for fever are plenty so we have to find out what are the causes of fever so for that you need to consult a physician you cannot prevent most of the fevers a few fevers like dengue and malaria which are vector borne fevers can be controlled by effectively uh, maintaining the hygiene around the environment in covid-19 disease in which individual hygiene matters a lot maintaining hygiene of your hand maintaining social distancing and using masks in a crowded places if the patient has fever with flu i request them to just isolate themselves to a single room and patient has any other symptoms aggravating like high grades of fever is still still persisting or breathing difficulty or something is something like that is that so for that you need to consult a physician with over 1 lakh medical experts and the facility to teleconsult experience clinic like consultations on practice